So the Steam Deck UI has just came to Windows and I'm here to show you how to download it on your Steam Deck. So having Windows on the Steam Deck is really fun but it comes with caveats and it's not the best to run on this system. So I guess something that would make it so much easier is having the Steam Deck UI on your Windows machine. So as you can see here, I closed my Steam application. I'm running Windows 10 on this machine. You can do this with Windows 11 as well. It runs just fine without any problems. So I'm gonna show you exactly what to do. It's three simple steps and they're very easy. So the first step is you need to go to the Steam settings on the Steam application. So go to the settings and in the account section, you need to look for the beta participation. Here you need to click change and then you make sure that you're in the beta. After that, you need to close your Steam uh, application for the next step to work. So make sure you exit Steam properly. So make sure you go to the tray right there and make sure you press exit so Steam is not running in the background. So after you've done that, you need to go to Steam itself and right click on it and go to properties. And at this here where it says target, you need to add something to make it run in the new uh, UI that they added so you need to type dash and then you type gamepad UI make sure you do this and uh, don't get the spelling wrong if you get it wrong your steam will not run at all not even properly because it will not understand what it needs to do so make sure you type it correctly after you've done that you need to click apply and give it permissions and press ok so after you've done these steps you are ready to run the new UI on your Steam Deck. So make sure you just run Steam and just wait for it to load. I'm gonna speed this up and show you the new system or the new UI they made for Windows. It's really neat. It makes it so much easier to run Windows on the Steam Deck before it was a hassle. So as you can see here, we have some settings. Quick settings you can access in every game. For example, you can change your brightness or turn off the haptic feedback. Here we're missing a lot of settings from the Steam Deck Linux version like the FSR or limiting the frame rates. We only have uh, showing the frame rates on the games, which is also neat. You don't need a third party app to show the frame rates. Also on the left side here, you have your library, your store, your downloads and your settings. All your settings are here, which makes it so much more convenient than exiting to Windows to modify stuff. Here you have everything in one place and you have your library, of course, to run the games so much easier than before. And that's it. This was a quick video to show you how to run the new UI on your Steam Deck. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, subscribe and peace.